Uh, good morning. Uh, it is my hope that you arrive safely. And uh, whatever happens, mathematics continue and Kenya won the last. So uh, yesterday, or uh, before you left for home, we were still going on with this topic of differentiation. And uh, we looked at the equation of the normal. I hope you went through the assignment. And in case you have an issue, you can channel the questions through the WhatsApp group. And uh, we will discuss them and respond to them. Today, I want us to learn about stationary points. That is the stationary points of a curve. And as you can see what I'm getting here, a stationary point is a point on a curve at which the gradient of that curve is zero. We have been getting the gradient of the curve through differentiation. When you differentiate, you remember, you are getting something called a derivative. And this derivative is the same as the gradient function or the gradient equation. So when you differentiate, it is possible to get the gradient of that curve at that particular point. Uh, there are several stationary points or they take different nature. But before we go to the nature of the, of the stationary points, I want us to take an example. And we find the stationary point of this curve, y is equal to x squared plus 4. When we differentiate this, dy will be x. It is equal to 2x. You remember how to differentiate it. Back to the definition of a stationary point, a stationary point is a point at which the gradient of the curve is zero. So it means that this gradient here, 2x, is equal to zero. So we are taking the gradient equation and equating it to zero to give us the point at which that curve uh, is stationary. So from here you get x is equal to what? x is equal to zero. This is just the value of x. You need to get the y coordinate. And you get the y coordinate by substituting the value of x in the equation. So substitute x is equal to zero in the equation y is equal to x squared plus 4, what do you get? You get y is equal to 4. So it means this curve has a stationary point at 0, 4. That is the stationary point of that curve. So we are simply getting the derivative or the gradient function, equating it to 0. And then we get the y value, we get the x value. Using the equation, we get the value of y. And when we have the two now, you get the coordinate. And the coordinate now is the stationary point. So the curve, y is equal to x squared plus 4, has a stationary point at 0, 4. I hope that point 